Hello Promising Traders, Alex here from PromisingTrader.com with your daily update on Doge, Coin, Bitcoin and then US Dollar. Now, uh, before I begin, this is only paper trading advice, I, please don't put your money where I'm saying money may go, I don't want you to lose money because I may be wrong, you know, I may be wrong and you should learn how to do your own due diligence, which you can learn if you click on the top right corner, there is a video that shows you how to set up TradingView for trading on paper trading so you will be able to place fake orders in the real exchange and see test strategies and see when you will be able to make real money out of it uh, I will also show you how to use my candle scanner which is unique you can only get it from me it shows you these reversal patterns that show you when the price is going to drop or when the price is going to go up and you can get it if you go on promisingtrader.com slash join the tribe also for both TradingView and the candle scanner there are links both in the description and in the pinned comment so you can get them from there the candle scanner is completely free I will also give you advice I will share my strategies with you and other things so yeah and also I will update you because as soon as I add new features I will give you the updated script so yeah you can get it from there now let's begin monthly view doge on the monthly view doge coin is green because it's been going up because bitcoin is about to drop that's it <laughs> and um, also please if you like this video don't forget to leave me a like i need to see interest to keep doing these videos because they are very demanding in terms of time so if i don't see people following me i would possibly stop doing it so please help me spreading the news so like the video share the video subscribe to the channel show me interest on dogecoin otherwise i will find out it's not what you want to see and i will not longer doing these videos so please let me know um the monthly view in the monthly view we can see that we are nearly at the bottom of the bollinger band but the more interesting thing is that it looks like digibuy has sorry dogecoin has found uh, support it found support in here with the lowest so it's been retesting this once and now I think it's really time to buy it's not time for shorting it so it's time to move Bitcoin into Doge I think but again this is just paper trading advice okay and um, yeah so what I see here is just a slight attempt for a reversal on MACD RSI is basically just hanging it there if we check here though RSI is slowly moving above 40 so I believe 2020 will be the year where we will see Doge making a rally I would not expect a rally to 190 but possibly you know something in the area of this shooting star here so something in the area of 84 which is an immense profit right now if you put money now you will have more than double as much whatever you put if you put 1000 you will have 2000 if you put Archer 2600 20 something hundred 25 let's say for simplicity so yeah I mean if you put 10,000 you will have 20,000 that's amazing isn't it so we need to see what happens um, because I don't think it's gonna happen right now so you still have time but if we go in the weekly for instance we still have resistance in here we can only see that the 8 EMA is about to approach a 21 EMA and it's not crossing it over yet however it's been closing above it once and twice and possibly this week also will we don't know RSI is just trying to break through the 50 here and it seems like it tried once it failed with this engulfing bear engulfing candle but every time it goes down it finds um, it goes it makes a new higher low you see it's trending up so to me I'm very optimistic MACD is already on a um, bull uh, pattern here so I am very optimistic but I don't think there will no longer be drops in the meantime I mean I think in the meantime we will see Doge dropping a, a little more again however in the daily there was another time the crossover of the 55 EMA which is very good so we need to see because every time it goes for um, breaking the 233 it looks like there is a lot of resistance you see so many people short it when it goes there 
Now, however, we are making, we are building pressure because the price didn't drop very much. Now the price is still stable here. Looks like it did find another area of uh, support in here, which I'm not gonna draw. And let's go in the 12 hours, which is the most interesting in Doge. In the 12 hours, we can confirm there was a crossover again because there was one here and now another one. And the retracement was about the same, but the 233 is now slightly lower than before. And I know this is going to break through eventually. I'm pretty much sure. You see it's double bouncing on RSI. On RSI, 50 has already been broken. Problem is that between the 12 hours and the daily, there is a huge discrepancy. Discrepancy. You see, the 233 is here, and in the 12 hours, the 233 is just below. So I think. Oh, let me see what's the value in here. It's at 34. Okay. So more or less where this stands. So it's just here. I think it will need to struggle a little more to break through this. You know, it will not just go through it. It will possibly try fail. Maybe this time finding support at the 233 EMA instead of crossing it over. And eventually I think it's going to break through. But Bitcoin, in my opinion, needs to make another rally. You see it's already bouncing. It's making another rally. And when the rally happens, Digibyte will drop, um, Dogecoin will drop again. Now, let me go and check the Doge US dollar, which I think is more or less the same. Yeah, in here I can see that it's still trying to break through the 233 EMA, but it looks like it's gonna make it because it's closing above it, even here is right now just once it closed below it but now actually it did it did actually break through you see 55 EMA is 0 0.00260917 and the 203 is 260730 so it's below it so the crossover has occurred now if you see MACD also it's trying to break uh, to, to trend up again but the unfortunate thing is that RSI is not showing any confirmation of that so price may still drop there is a chance that the price drops and um, in the meantime I do another another line so yeah there is a chance that the price drops and um, let me try to figure out on the daily how it looks like okay yeah that's why <laughs> because on the daily it's still struggling here and it looks like it's going to make for a retest so yeah in my opinion we will see doge dropping again possibly just in this area not here so it may just drop here not enough probably to make the crossover because the crossover has just occurred so yeah like something like here you see this area here and then we'll try to break it again after all, it's very difficult to see these mm, crossovers happening like if it was butter. There's always resistance or support, depending. In this case, it's resistance. Uh, so yeah, expect a little, a little fail in the attempt of breaking through, and then let's see what happens from there. But on the daily, that's what it looks like. Let me check on the weekly. On the weekly, it's very good. On the weekly, Doge is to be bought, really. Um, seems like it found support at the 233 EMA RSI is now trending up MACD just did the crossover so it looks like a good investment to me right now to be made in terms of investment because I know how long it's gonna take to becoming profitable for real if you trade and even on the monthly so it looks very good it looks like this one was the first impulse wave it really looks good actually um, or Mm, yeah, it cannot be lower than that after all. Yeah, I mean it can go lower than that But um, yeah, so it looks like on a on a long term is very profitable But on a shorter term meaning in the 12 hours or even immediately It may drop more for a few days weeks But then I think it's gonna break through so yeah, 
looks like a very good investment if you want to buy some Doge coins. Okay, my time is over. I was about to say anyway, I'm done. I wish you a good day. Please let me know what you think. Like, share and subscribe as I asked. Please do. And I will see you tomorrow with another update. Thank you for watching. Bye-bye.